What's up guys? Today we're going to be taking a look at the Bowers & Wilkins CT 7.4 LCRS. LCRS stands for left, center, right, and surround. So you can use these for any channel in a surround sound setup. Now these are a part of their custom theater line, hence the CT. There's three models in the lineup. The CT 7.5, which is the small version. The 7.4s, these guys and the 7.3s, which are the biggest ones. We'll be taking a look at the middle ones. Now, before we get these things unboxed, if you've got an interest in home theater, hi-fi, or movies, then consider tapping the subscribe button for new weekly videos. Inside, we get some documentation, a speak-on connector, mounting brackets for wall mounting, two foam plugs if you want to use these sealed, and here we have the speaker grill. These are some hefty speakers weighing in at 34.7 pounds. Size-wise, they're 17.5 inches wide, by 13.5 inches high, by 10.5 inches deep. They've got a textured matte black finish, which will be highly non-reflective if they're going to be placed out in the open. Up front, you'll find two 6.5-inch mid-bass drivers with a frequency response down to 49Hz. Up top is B&W's famous Nautilus tube loading tweeter. It's flanked by two ports that can be sealed using the included foam plugs. Around back you'll find the binding posts, or you can connect to your amp using the included speak-on connector. If you're going to mount to a wall, there are pre-drilled holes for the wall mounts, and there are more mounting points underneath the speaker. Now since this is part of B&W's custom theater lineup, they are designed to be hidden behind a screen or out of sight, hence the non-decorative matte black finish. But if you do decide to keep these out in the open, it might be wise to cover the soft dome tweeter with the included magnetic grill, because if you've got little ones, those soft dome tweeters might just get pushed in. At the time of this video, the CT 7.4s retail for $1,200 each. As mentioned before, you can use these as either left, center, right, or surround channels. I think it'd be interesting to see how having 11 identical speakers would sound for home theater. Hmm. Well, thanks for watching, guys. If you've had any experience with the BMW CT series of speakers or BMW in general, then leave a comment and let me know what you think of them. Be sure to give the video a thumbs up if you like the video, and of course, tap the subscribe button if you're not a subscriber. And we'll see you guys again in the next one.